more. Yeah, maybe up a little bit more. I don't know how it can go. You can put this one on there. Okay. It's okay. All right. I can set that my No, it didn't. It's on. Hi, everyone. Hi. Thanks for tuning in. You're going to watch me make, um, turn on that light there, maybe. We're going to make pina colada. We're making pina colada today. Hi, Ems. Hi, Nicole Anderson. How are you guys today? Are you guys excited for this pina colada drink? We're just putting a little bit of rum in there. <laughs> okay. Okay, we're gonna get started soon. Hi, Ems. Oh, did I say hi to Ems? Turn on that light there. Okay, guys, so I have all our ingredients here. I have pineapple. There's some pineapple. We have <laughs> we have coconut milk. We have some the Williams family says hi. Hi, Williams Dad family. Says hi. Ooh. Oh, hi everyone. Okay, so we're here making pina colada. So I'm just showing you the ingredients. So I have some coconut milk here. I got some condensed milk whitener. So this one is not as sweet as the condensed milk itself. And I picked this up at the grocery store. It's just basically a pina colada mixture. So basically it smells a little bit of coconut, pineapple in here. And um, a little bit of spirit in there. And you gotta put ice. So we're gonna get started. And of course, you need your blender. You need a blender here. Okay, so let's get started. I don't know if you can see. Okay, so here's the blender, guys. So I'm just gonna sit here and put all our ingredients in here. So first of all, I'm gonna put the pineapple. Oops, pineapple. Okay, we have our coconut milk. Okay, there's a coconut milk. And what else? And we have our pina colada mixture. We're gonna put, oh, so it was uh, one and a half cup of coconut milk and about, say you can do half cup to a cup of uh, frozen pineapple chunks. Nicole Anderson said how much coconut milk? One and a half cup coconut milk. Okay, so I have my pina colada cocktail mixture here that I picked up from the grocery store. Okay, so we're putting it in here too. Okay, and I have um, a, this is a cocktail pina colada rum mixture. So I don't know if it's, no, there's no rum in it, but it's, I guess, uh, Syrup, yes, it's a syrup. Thank you, Kristen. <laughs> ah, so syrup. So I'm just gonna put like maybe a teaspoon of it in here. You don't want too much syrup in there. And we need ice. So Kristen, can you please get me the ice? Absolutely. Thank you. Big helper today. Big, big helper. Okay, so you need your tray of ice. Okay. And when do you need, oh, let me put this in first. Okay, so we got our condensed milk sweetener. Okay, so here it goes. Okay, guys, this is not as sweet as condensed milk itself. It's basically just, I should say, whitener. It's a whitener. And you need ice. So you can put half this tray, right? Yeah. Half this tray of ice in there. I've been feeling to go out and get a pina colada, so I'm just like, why not just make it at home? And when you make it at home, you can put as much spirit as you want <laughs> in it. Okay, you read in the comments anywhere else? Okay, and where, when do we add our spirit? <laughs> and said, how much rum? <laughs> Um, I would say to be safe on this one, maybe two, you can put one to two tablespoon or, yeah. Okay, so not much is left in this bottle. So I'd say I just added one tablespoon. 
of rum. Okay, so now we are going to blend. Williams family said, yes, that's true. Love me some pina colada. If with lots of rum, eh? <laughs> <laughs> we're not doing virgin pina colada here. Okay, because we're home, so we don't need to do virgin pina colada. I said that's not enough rum. You need at least one cup. Uh, <laughs> one cup? Okay. Okay. Hold on, guys. <laughs> little glitch here. <laughs> oh, okay. There we go. Okay, this is loud, so just bear with me. Read in the comment, guys, so you can. I did. Where's okay. Yes, I did. She just asked if I add the pineapple. Okay. There we go. Um, yes, please. More ice, please. Where's the, here's the ice. Here's the ice. Okay. So guys, just add the whole tree of ice. M said, why bother buying drinks at a restaurant when you can make them at home? That's right. That's but it's right. also nice to go out for It's nice to go out for drinks sometimes, yes. It's nice to go out for drinks, you know? Socialize. That one is not good. Okay. Okay, Christian's getting more ice for us, guys. You can comment and tell me. What drink did you have lately? Did you go out for the drink? Or do you make your own drink at home, right? If it's carrot juice, you can tell me about it because I know that you added uh, wine and rum in your carrot juice, All right? So what drink did you have lately? Did you go out or did you stay home? There you go. Thank you, Kristen. Okay, let's do this again. too watery okay so did we have everything yes and we did add the rum right and yeah so Ooh, nicole said a grapefruit mimosa with brunch Ooh. That, i love a mimosa mimosa with but brunch. i've never had a grapefruit mimosa. grapefruit yeah no never that had sounds it. delicious yes it does okay guys so we have our garnish here for our for our pina colada so this here is pineapple and a cherry. Isn't this a cute umbrella? Kristen broke the umbrella. She was out. <laughs> I can shoot this. Isn't that pretty? Yes. Okay. So now, after mixing our pina colada, that didn't take too long, does it? Put all your ingredients in the blender. Put your ice throw as much. I didn't have enough rum, but next time, next time. Okay. Use up all my rum for the bacon and stuff. Okay. So here you need a pretty glass. That's oh. enough rum for a weekday. For a weekday. Yes. This is enough <laughs> rum for a weekday, especially if you have to, you know, you have babies. Look at this guys. So this will be my, look at that. That's going to be my glass for my pina colada, but I can't, I'll pour it in here later. I'm just going to, oops, I'm just going to use this one just show you what it looks like look at that guys comment below yeah Nicole said grapefruit mimosa what did everybody else have oh she had grapefruit mimosa did she go out she and said for brunch for brunch okay did she go out and have brunch or did she have a brunch at home okay guys look at this isn't this beautiful? and said what a fancy looking glass Candace says, I love your pineapple glass. Oh, thank you. Candace, I had that pineapple glass for how long? For about a couple of years. Christian got me that because I was like obsessed over it. And I think this is the first time I'm, look at this. Ooh. Cheers. Cheers. Delish. Thank you. Now we're going to taste. Oh my God, this is so good. Seriously, that is so good. Have some, Christian. I want Cheers. you to taste. Yes. Okay. So we're going to do a glass for Christian here. Thank you. That's good. That's good. 
you have to have the pretty for that. That's Christian. Here, there you go. Nicole said, "Cheers." Candace says, "Cheers." Williams family says, "Cheers." Cheers. I love mine with whipped cream. With That's whipped cream, a good yes, idea. yes, yeah. yes, yes. First time I had a pina colada was my 18th birthday. My cousin took me out for my birthday. That was like, that was just the other day, guys. Um, <laughs> yeah, that was a few years ago, my 18th birthday. And I remember that night, I probably had about four pina coladas, my 18th birthday. Oh my God, it was so good. Are you? Why are you choking, Christine? <laughs> she is choking, like why? But anyways, that was the first time I had a pina colada. So, um, Nicole, you said you had a mimosa. Candice, what did you have? What was your last drink? What was a cocktail drink that you had lately? And William's family, you must be having enough drinks. I know where you are, so <laughs> you must be having enough nice drinks where you're at, right? Cubs dead said, me too. I just turned 10. <laughs> Cubs dead. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh my gosh. No, this is real good. Good. Mm -hmm. Remember, you could make your own. This more tastes like a virgin pina colada because it was only like, see, there's no more rum in the bottle. I should have gotten a bottle. Probably put what? It was about what? Teaspoon? It, it still, you can taste yeah, it. Yeah, you can still yeah. taste it a bit. Mm. So, what do you guys do today? Um, Candace said I had sorrel and ginger beer. Ooh, sorrel and ginger beer. Was that homemade, Candace? I think everyone wants to know probably how you made your sorrel if you ha if you add uh, rum to it or wine, wine and rum. Mm. This is so good, guys. Look at that. So good. Mm. This tastes better than the last pina colada I had. And I forgot where I went. I think it was a local restaurant here in Toronto. Pina colada wasn't worth the price. So, guys, if you want to make this at home, all you need is here. I don't know why I keep. I think I'm going to knock this off the table. Let me put it up here. All you need is your condensed milk whitener, your coconut milk. Just get one of these, guys. You could even get this. You know what? You can find this at the dollar store, honestly. I think it was like $3. Yeah. Or, um, yes, three bucks. And um, your ice, your pineapple. Don't forget, if you don't have like pineapple chunks, you can use pineapple juice. You can use pineapple juice to do it and your ice. That's all you need. You know what's good if you add maybe vanilla ice cream if you want it like decadent you can use vanilla ice cream and Williams was it Williams family that said whipped cream yes your vanilla ice cream whip it up and then put your whipped cream on top and your garnish yep. mm -hmm. Williams family said the pina colada at the keg is so good it yeah. is good yes yeah. yes 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 it is I think um, I had it before in Niagara Falls. Yeah. yeah. I went to the keg before I hit the casino. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it is good. But baking at home is more economic. Because a glass like this at the keg would probably be like what? Twenty five bucks. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Mm. So guys, um, did everybody, yeah, so I was asking what drinks did you make lately, carrot juice, or do you make, um, do you usually make a drink, um, do you usually make a drink, like, hey, get your own. on Sundays for, to pair with your food? Hey. Because I think that's like a West Indies thing. Like any fruit you find, you usually make a drink, a juice. I just said yes to what? I think uh, she made her own. Oh! With wine and rum. 
Oh, you made your own with wine and rum. That's great, Candace. Was it Sora from Christmas or was it, um, did you make it recent? Because some people still have like their bottles of sorrel in the fridge from Christmas. Mm. From Christmas. For, from Christmas? Whoa, that must be strong. <laughs> <laughs> It'll knock you out. Mm -hmm. <laughs> So Mrs. Club's Den, um, have you ever had pina colada? <laughs> She's probably like a force. Mm. So I finally satisfied my craving, guys. I've won the pina colada now for I think the whole year I've been thinking about the pina colada and I keep saying, I'm going out, yeah, I'm going out, I'm going out. your birthday. Yes. <laughs> so for my birthday, guys, I have to tell you a story about how, oh, wicked, story. how wicked Christian is, okay? How wicked she is. So they tricked me. They told <laughs> She told me that uh, she's going to take me to the CN Tower for my birthday. So I was all excited. She goes, yeah, you're going to have your pina colada finally. You know, they, they have great pina coladas there at their restaurant at the um, CN Tower. So I'm like, okay. You know, I had pina colada on my mind to get at CN Tower for the for like the whole, what, two weeks that I knew about this birthday dinner. And it just ended up that drove, she drove me around the CN Tower almost two times and then finally took me to my surprise birthday party. <laughs> It was nice. It was it was family, real nice. It was real nice. Family and friends. You know, I was happy to see, you know, people I haven't seen in years. But she but, wanted her pina colada. But I didn't get the pina colada. <laughs> and I've been living in Toronto for most of my life, which I which, you know, it's been not too long since I'm since I'm just a couple of years past eighteen. <laughs> so so yeah, never been to CN Tower. And um, yeah, but anyways, I'll go one day. But I did make my own pina colada today. Uh, Nicole said, I'm craving one now. And Candace said, me too. Yes. Come oh, over and yeah. And or just or just get all these stuff, guys. Go to your dollar store, right? And get this. See, look, you can see it. Get your mixture. It's about three bucks. Get your condensed milk white in Walmart. It's like $1.49. You know, your little rum, your coconut, the coconut milk is what? One, what, one thirty? They have a great Caribbean sale right now at the stores because of the long weekend. You know, just get all your stuff. And this is a perfect drink. Your nephew, Amir, said tell to tell you hi. Hi, Amir. Love you. Mwah. Love you so much. Can't wait to see you. Can't wait to see you, baby. Nicole said, haven't been there either. Got We got to go. Yes. Oh, she have not been there. I thought it was just me one. <laughs> I thought it was just me alone. Cubs Den, have you been to CN Tower? Can't I know you said, I'll get my ingredients this week. Yes, 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 yes. All these ingredients won't even cost you, probably cost you, what, a little bit over $10 except for the rum, right? You know, bottles of rum now is sky high. I know. Uh, anyways, that's another. That's another story. <laughs> Put well, some water in the cheese. Yes, yes. Else. Williams family house Romario. How's he doing? At least I put some water in it and shake it out. <laughs> mm -mm. Mm. This is so good. So good. This would have been perfect for Caravan weekend. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Have you been to the CN Tower Cubs Den? And William, this goes for William's family also. Everyone, that question. So come on, guys, let me know. And you know what I'm, I'm curious about? 
what type of interesting um, food and snack are they going to bring to the CNE this year? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I got to go. I'm going to go to CNE, guys. And hopefully, yes, I am. She's going to roll her eyes. I'm going to go to the CNE and try something different. Hmm. Your nephew, Amir, wants a virgin pina colada. Oh, of course, Amir. Will you come. <laughs> Trust me, Auntie's gonna make you the best pina colada you ever had. The best. Auntie's gonna make you the best pina colada. Candace said, I wanna go to the CNA this year too. William Shamley said, have not been there in years. The CNE? Same here. Same here. I haven't been there. Um I don't know, but it's I better just to go at night. At night? Really? Like when the sun goes down, oh, it's yeah. not so hot mm -hmm. walking around. Mm -hmm. That's true. I haven't been there. It was a tradition years ago to like, you know, go there the end of summer. We used to go there on the what on the last day. And but you know, when you're younger, you don't mind crowd. You don't mind pushing through crowd and all that. But when you get older, you kinda want you you know, can't bother with the crowd. Especially everything that's going on nowadays, but yeah. Any more comments? Hmm. You posted a video today. What was the video you posted? You guys, I posted a video today. Please check it out. It's uh, honey garlic wings, chicken wings. And I made the honey garlic sauce from scratch. Very easy, very tasty, delicious. You're going to be surprised on how the sauce, um, how good the sauce is. Just try that recipe. It's better than store-bought honey garlic sauce. Way better. Was it good, Kristen? She was like, it was delicious. It was so delicious. Good. The wings were so good. And the thing yeah. is, after like I coated the wings and fried it, you can you can also do the wings in your air fryer or in the oven, right? So you can you can fry wings in the oven or in your air fryer. And you know, after you add your honey garlic sauce, it's still crispy, yep. which is so interesting. It was so good. Just try, check out the video. I even had the rest today. I warmed up some today. Oh yeah? It was still crispy. Well, she's telling me that she had the three that was left and I had my, my, my mind on that. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. And it was still crispy, right? Yeah, it was. You know what I think it is? I think it's the um, cornstarch that's in oh, the flour. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 The poll said, yes, it looks so good. We'll be trying that. Mm -hmm. Try it. Candace said, maybe c &E will have deep fried O. Henry bars this year. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Did they have that last year, Candace? I don't know about the deep fried candy bar. Yeah, usually deep fried Oreos. Yes. Those are pretty good. I think the I deep tried fried Oreos? Before, yeah. I've never tried it. It's uh, very interesting, yeah. though. Oh, last... I don't know if they had it this year, but I know last year they had, like, ketchup and mustard-flavored ice cream. Oh, yes, it was last yes. year. Last year they had ketchup mustard ice cream. Oh, my goodness. Yes. Mm -mm. I, I just can't I just can't wrap my brain around the mustard. Did anyone you try know? it? Have you guys ever tried that? The mustard and ketchup ice cream? Maybe this year they'll have relish. Ew. Lord have mercy, Ooh. no. That's basically pickles. Like yeah, pickles. exactly, pickle. Well, maybe I don't know. Deep fried, yeah. They had, they do have the, deep fried pickles. Yeah, yeah. they had the um, the uh, burger, the Krispy Kreme donut burger. Oh, that was the year. Or the donut burger. Yeah, that was that was what a couple of years ago. Yeah, they had a Krispy Kreme donut burger, and then they had to they had to um get rid of it because I think someone had a heart attack or something. I think. You read uh -huh. Nicole said there was no O. Henry. They, the attraction is the ketchup ice cream. Oh, last year. Oh this yeah. Year. This year? This year? Yeah. Cause they had, you know, okay. and other problems. Yes. 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 Oh, started, yes, so. yes. 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 Oh yeah. Nicole, you went to um the CNE where you, okay. 
Candace, uh, William's family said no, never tried. Candace said never tried the ice cream. Mm -hmm. Would you guys try mm -hmm. the ice cream though? Would you yeah. try it? I definitely would not. I don't think so. I think I would try. I'd I would try Just it. Just thinking about yeah. eating Since ketchup, I'm a, like yes. think about like ketchup as an ice cream. Like when you eat it, you just take ketchup. Like I can't get over that. Ketchup as ice cream. <laughs> I, I don't know. Like, I just I'll try it though. Alone, yeah. no. Like if someone gets it, and I'll try a bit, but I'm not buying it. <laughs> yeah, Candace said she would not try it. Mm -hmm. Imagine you definitely get probably upset stomach after that. Oh my goodness. Probably like take uh like uh a taste no. and then throw the rest of the garden. Yeah, yeah. But I'm just curious to see what they come up with this year. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Candace said I'm worried about a tummy ache. Yeah. Yes, of course. They also oh. have the blooming onion. That looks good. The blooming, blooming. onion. Oh, oh yes. Yeah. That yeah, looks yeah, really yeah. good. Yeah, yeah. That looks good. That's not that that's not weird. Yeah. But they need me to um come up with an ice cream for them. I think I'd probably do um Maybe a jerk flavored ice I knew cream. You were gonna say that. <laughs> jerk flavored ice cream. Jerk uh -huh. flavored ice cream. Yes. No. Yes. Uh -huh. Yes. And listen. I would not try that. Get a lot of sale for that. What do you guys think? No. If you had to think about a ice cream flavor, what would you what would you come up with? What would you come up with? I say jerk because everybody, you know, it's like they're so curious about jerk, you know. Jerk chicken, jerk this, jerk that. Jerk flavored ice cream. <laughs> M said oxtail flavored ice cream. <laughs> Ox oh, the flavor. Okay. okay. No, you can't do like no, savory no, and it just no. doesn't work. Steel, Ooh, but that's like no. A, no, but you know what? Imagine no, there's like oxtail yeah, chunks in it. Yeah. But listen though, no, no oh. oxtails are like, okay, when I say jerk, okay, jerk is a flavor. Right, it's uh, spices and all that, so that's not too bad because jerk really have what in it? Garlic, cinnamon, brown sugar, right? Thyme, pepper. That's not too weird. Fermento. Garlic ice cream. Yeah, fermento. They have garlic ice cream. There's garlic ice cream. Trust me. The closest that they might have it in Japan. The jerk oh, ice cream. Oh, the jerk ice. Trust me, jerk ice cream. You know what? Mega try something. I'm gonna try something. I have. You're gonna cream. try it a little. No, I'm gonna I'm not try. Listen, that. I'm gonna try that recipe. You guys dare me to do it? No, no. I don't. No, I mean I'm gonna make it. I'm gonna create a jerk. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm gonna, no, I'm gonna create a jerk flavored no. ice cream. Okay. Oxo ice cream would be expensive. Whoever wants me to do it, just do a thumbs up. Thumbs up. Just just show me thumbs up if you want me to do I'll put a, thumbs down a jerk flavored ice cream. Nobody's doing it. The thumbs up. ice cream would be so expensive. Don't let, no M's no no honey <laughs> no no no. You put thumbs thumbs up guys if you want me to do the jerk flavored ice cream. No. It's not a chicken flavor or be it's just the flavor like the jerk. No. There you go. Nicole says yes. <laughs> no. Nicole Do says not yes. encourage this. <laughs> yes, jerk flavored ice cream. Mm -hmm. You guys, please like up the live. Please like up the live and please share. You know, this is a fantastic. Oh, see, I'm halfway through it. I can't believe it. And this is not sweet, guys. This does not. It's a sweet person. It doesn't taste. No, you get the like pineapple. A lot of coconut flavor. Yes, yes. It's really good. Yes, pineapple coconut flavor. It's not sweet. See, Williams family's with me. Not did sure about that one. Did you, did, what did you, <laughs> come on, come on, Williams no. family. Jerk flavored ice cream. Uh-uh. Yeah. Probably have it in Jamaica. No. It prob it's probably in Jamaica. Check it out and let me know, Williams family. Check it out. It's probably there already. No more thumbs up. Uh, can't, can't put a thumbs down. Can't. <laughs> oh my See? goodness. Jerk flavor. But yeah, but it's not like a jerk chicken. It's not like Ooh, a... Oh, Williams tell me, so what about jackfruit ice cream? Yes, yes. And I love the jackfruit. You know, I have a jackfruit juice on my channel. It's a, yeah, jackfruit juice. Yes. Jackfruit smoothie. It's a smoothie yes. I have. Of course. Candice said, 
make a pina colada ice cream. Yes, that's a good idea. And there, there's lots of pina coladas ice cream out there, right? Yeah. I think there, yeah. I think there is. Mm -hmm. There are pina coladas. Really good. Yeah, sure there are pina really colada good. ice cream up in there. Yes, but that's a good idea, Candice. Thank you. Thank Jackfruit you. Jackfruit ice cream, I think, would be good. Jackfruit ice yeah. cream, yes. William's family, I love, when I tell you that I love jackfruit, I love jackfruit, okay? Too I much. Too much. No, it's not too much. Yeah. I bought a whole jackfruit. Many times. Um, I think last year. Yeah. And I, did I share it? It just stains the knife. It stains. Yeah, it stains the knife. But it's so good. I mean, you can mm. eat it until you just become, um, what do you call it? Clyden. It's kind of Clyden if you eat too much. Yeah. If you eat too much of it. But I love it. And I know you're probably in jackfruit paradise right now, William's family. Don't even show me your jackfruit in your videos. Okay, William? <laughs> oh, gosh. William's family said, me too. One of my favorite fruits. Mm -hmm. Yes, I know that. Fruit fly. Do you like, uh, do you like jackfruit, Nicole? Mrs. Club's Den? Was it on? Candice, um, Candice, do you like? Uh, William's family, I know she, I'm, yes, William's family. Well, I know that they do, she does. William Sally says, haven't gotten any yet. Really? And I've seen like, I've seen like a um, few Jamaican videos and I've seen that like, you know, it's like stuck to the tree. You know how they grow? I don't know. I was just, just going to ask if they grow like on the ground or No, it's a, a tree. tree. But they're so heavy. They're heavy. Don't stand under the tree. Because they'll knock you out. They will knock Ooh, you out. Oh, Nicole said Ginnip or June Plum ice cream. Ginnip is the best. Yeah, but how would you how would you make Ginnip ice cream though? You'd have to use a Because it's so small. You'd have to use a lot of Ginnip. I don't know. The juice. I don't know what you'd have to do. Well, his family said yes, they grow on trees. Mm -hmm. That's a heavy tree. Yeah. Yeah. Candice said, not sure I've ever tried jackfruit. Try it, Candice. Try it. Try it. It's so good. It is so good. I'm sure there's somewhere you could go to just get in like a container, like, you know, like what? the jackfruit already. So you don't have to cut it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They sell it in the Haitian markets and the Not can. in the can. I'm talking like in the, like a... A clear container. You know? Oh, okay. They do sell it, but yeah, like fresh. Not yeah, yeah, yeah. They sell fresh. <laughs> they sell fresh. It, it's uh, cheaper if you buy the whole jackfruit. Yeah. The whole jackfruit is what? They're selling enough for 99 cents a pound. If you sell it like, you know, and you cut it in quarters and half, two nine nine. dollars oh. Candace said, I love Guinness. Me too. Me too. I love Guinness. Someone sent me some Guinness, but we never got it. And they sell it expensive. Yeah. Someone sent us some uh, from Trinidad, but we didn't get it. I think they probably ate it at the airport. <laughs> <laughs> so it's sweet. okay. Are you getting any Guinness, Williams family? Did you get any Guinness? Yet? Yet, 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 yet. Hmm. Is is Jackson up? We should let him join. Yeah. Oh, Jackson wants to say hi, guys. Jackson. I think he's playing his. Game. Oh, he's playing this game. Well, that's how he said yes a lot. We have a tree in our backyard. Oh my gosh! I would just sit under oh the tree. Oh my god! Don't tell us that, please. Eat everything. Oh my goodness! Stay in Jamaica. You don't want to come back to you. <laughs> Mm -mm. They're like six dollars for a small bag. Yes, and they're not even. You know what? And when you buy here, it's like most I of don't. Them are rotten. Most of them are rotten. Yes, most of them are rotten. A tree in your backyard. We had we have a tree in my grandparents' um, backyard, but I don't even know if it's still there. Honestly, I don't know if it's still there. What other trees you have in your backyard, William family? 
You might see me tomorrow now because I might jump on a plane to, tonight and come. So you might yeah, see me. Come, say hi. We're on live. Hi, me. Hi. Say, say hi. Hi. Okay, wait, let's plug this out. We don't need this anymore. Oh, here's Jackson, guys. Hi. <laughs> see, look. See, they're, they wrote comments right there. Yeah. You see? What huh? kind of ice cream do you like? What kind of ice cream do you like, Jackson? I want chocolate ice cream. Chocolate. I love, I love sprinkles. Chocolate, chocolate ice cream with sprinkles. Oh, chocolate ice cream with sprinkles. Yeah. Say hi to our friends. See, they're writing. They're saying hi, Jackson. <laughs> okay, you say hi. Okay. R M C N Y says amazing family. Oh. Say thank you. Thank you. Candace thank says hi, Jackson. Nicole says hi, Jax. Say hi. Say hi, hi. Nicole. Say hi, Nicole and Candace. Hi, Nicole and Candace. <laughs> Say how are you? Mwah, I love you. Push up your glasses. Push up your glasses. Good job. Am I? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Jackson loves. What else do you like to eat, Jackson? Mm, I want to eat. Do you like pina coladas? No. No. <laughs> no. That's okay. This one's not for you. Yeah. Yeah. Like this. Oh, this is my <laughs> this is my pineapple glass. Oh, look. Look, an umbrella. Look. Take wow. it. Wow. Yep. Any What's message? your favorite food to eat, Jax? Um, patty? Yeah. You love patty? Yeah. Oh, Jackson loves patties, pizza. Today, what did Jackson, what did you eat today? What did you have today for supper? What did you eat today for dinner? Tell um, them. Donna, Donna. No, 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 that was lunch. <laughs> but you did have McDonald's for dinner. What do you have for dinner? Rice. Do, yeah. And fish. Yeah. What fish? <laughs> no. <laughs> you Not had, fish. You had rice and fish for dinner. No. I don't want this. And you had two little bowls, remember? No. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. Okay, you okay. go play your game. Okay, say bye. Say good night, everybody. Good night, Betty, buddy. Okay. Okay, he's going to go play his game. Oh, boy. Jackson is a whole vibe. <laughs> questions? So what are you guys doing for the rest of the night? You guys oh, the Nicole said there was a patty festival the other day. Did you go? Where, Nicole? Where? There was one. Yeah, there was one. Um, I think it was on Eglinton. Oh, patty festival? Don't you remember telling you? Oh, yes. Yeah. yes, 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 yes. <clears throat> it was on the weekend. Oh, there was, oh yes, you were telling yeah. me about it. There were so many festivals. I, won't, I haven't, you know, I was kind of busy. I was real busy on the weekend. But, um, so, but I'm just sorry I missed it. That must have been amazing. All the different types of yeah, patty. Yeah, stuffed patty. I'm sure they had oxtail patty yeah. because they're doing everything with oxtail right now. Yep. Every single thing. Oxtail, what? Tacos, oxtail, nachos, every single thing you can think of. William Shabby said coconut, jackfruit, juice, plum, mango, almond, orange, banana, pineapple. You'll have in your backyard, right? Oh, my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> you don't even need to leave. You I know. Just... I know. I'll Survive come down. Animal. William's family. William's family. I'll come. I'll be your personal chef. Okay. If you allow me <laughs> access to all the tree, them. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be your personal chef. Okay. If I have access to all your fruit trees. William Sammy says he's so big now. He isn't he? Yeah. You guys met him when he was, uh, when he was what? I think eight months. I think eight months or so. She said, anytime my door is open. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. Love you. Love you. William's family, um, Shan. <clears throat> I appreciate Shan so much. You know, Shan, Shan also encouraged me to start a YouTube channel. She, she encouraged me. I remember she would ask me like, every week oh did you start yet did you she goes did you do a video yet that was so you know that was so sweet that was so sweet but uh trying to be consistent now shan thank you so much
So what's your next video you're posting? My next video is going to be, uh, I want to do a dessert. I want to do a dessert. So um, um, I'm thinking it's going to be something uh, tropical, maybe a coconut, maybe a coconut cake or something like that. All right? It's going to be something great, something good. Something delicious. What do you guys want to see? What do you guys? What would you guys like me to post next? Just uh, give me some ideas, please. Thank you. I just said I love coconut. Same here. I love coconut. I mean, I love coconut. I mean, I bought a coconut the other day. I cracked it, and I was just eating, having it for a snack. Kristen's coming back to read the comments. She's coming back because I'm not wearing my reading glasses, you guys. <laughs> Kathy said something with lemon. Williams family said, yes, coconut cake is great. Yes. I'm going to make a coconut. Or some do you have that condensed milk cake on your... Yeah, I think you do. Yes, oh, I have a so con good. condensed milk cake. Guys, you should check out it's that video. So delicious. So delicious. And I know when you hear about condensed milk, you might think, oh, my God, it's so sweet. No, 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 not sweet at all. It flies. Yeah. It's not sweet at all. So good. Yeah. So Candace said, uh, who M said maybe a cheesecake? Cheesecake? What kind of cheesecake? What kind of, what type of cheesecake, so M's? Many. Yeah, so many. You have cherry cheesecake, you have um, vanilla. I have a vanilla cheesecake on the channel. That one is so good. Yeah, well, I have said, yes, I've heard of the condensed milk. Yes, yes, yes. Have you tried it? Have you had it? It's, it's really my favorite. It's so yes. Good. So, so far I got um, coconut cake, lemon, like a lemon loaf, Candice. Ooh, that would be good. Lemon loaf, yeah, because you know what? I think I will do a lemon loaf. I love the lemon loaf they have at Starbucks. Yeah, it's good. Mm -hmm. Starbucks uh, lemon loaf is so good. Any more ideas? Jerk ice cream? Peanut punch cake. <laughs> peanut, that was, whose idea is that? Fine. Oh, peanut punch cake. <laughs> peanut punch cake. Okay. I think that would be Okay, said. yeah, okay. Jot that down. Peanut punch cake. When Luca's sleeping. <laughs> yeah. Have to be when Luca is sleeping, guys. He's allergic to peanuts. He is so allergic. Candace put, oh, she put a coconut, oh, coconut lemon. And said maybe a no big cheesecake and a regular cheesecake and do a comparison. Oh, so great idea. idea. Good idea. Yes. So write it down. Where you have to get? <laughs> yes, okay. you will. Mm -hmm. The no big cheesecake is like, I don't know, it's, it's, it's more less like, like uh, dense. Mm -hmm. It's more like, Creamy. It's more like a, yes, more like a jello pudding kind of thing, mm -hmm. no? Like a mousse. Yeah, yeah. yeah exactly. It's a yeah. mousse. It's a mousse. It's a mousse. Uh, Nicole said, Amir is requesting Jamaican cookies. Jamaican cookies. Oh, like oh. ginger snap cookies? Ginger would be Jamaican or uh, coconut, ginger, coconut, mango. <laughs> yeah. Mango. William's family said, can't wait for my Christmas rum cake. <laughs> Christmas oh is right God. around the corner. Yes, Christmas right around the corner, Williams family. Don't worry. Our Christmas is jam-packed. Yes. Christmas and Luca's birthday. Guys, get this, okay? So, Luca. Luca is my seven-month-old grandson, Jackson's brother. He was born on Christmas Day. So now, how are we going to... How are we going to figure that? Yeah. He was born on Christmas Day. Um, but your Christmas, the Christmas cakes are still coming. They're going to come. Yep. Yeah. Last year I wasn't really, you know, didn't really have time, you know, because there was a Luca coming. We, you know, Christmas was, was, was delayed. Yeah. Well, it was delayed. Christmas was delayed. Yeah. We us. even opened the gifts late. Like yeah. Two days. Two days after, after Christmas yeah. was gifts. But uh, 
this year we're back on schedule. So Williams family may have you upon the list. <laughs> may have you on the list. And it's commented so I didn't say I can't see it. Well, cassava. Cassava cake. Cassava porn. <laughs> M's wants okay. Cassava. Do I have a cassava? I think so. No, I don't. Okay. No, I don't. I have um sweet potato pudding. Okay, right. we'll do a cassava porn. My aunt, oh my goodness, guys. I have an auntie, okay. Her cassava porn is, oh my goodness, hands down the best I've ever had. The best, the best. <laughs> I keep asking her, can I come in your kitchen? And you keep asking her for the recipe <laughs> and she keeps delaying. <laughs> yes. And then I finally ask her, can I come in your kitchen and just, you know, record you making that beautiful, <laughs> that <laughs> she delicious She doesn't want anyone porn. to know her recipe. She <laughs> says, no, I'll, she said, no, I'll tell you and you do it. But yeah. Well, guys, yes. You know what? I don't need her recipe. I don't need her recipe. I, I'll, I'll figure it out. Don't make it <laughs> you. Candace says, a nice lemon loaf with a nice lemon cream drizzle on top. Yes. Done. Okay, see? Kristen's making a list. With a nice lemon cream? She says drizzle? Yeah. Mm -hmm. You really go into detail eh, about the cream? <laughs> yes. Okay, any more ideas? Any more ideas? Let me see what I was thinking of, really. I was really thinking about the coconut cake to a nice, yes. fluffy, nice coconut cake. And um, the cassava porn is definitely coming. Um, I think we should do like an ube cake. Ube cake? Yeah. Like a, a purple like a, yeah, a it's purple yam. Yeah. Okay, we'll try that. Yeah. I love a Remember challenge. We had the ube cake. Mm -hmm. the yes, cake yes. So ube cake is, uh, is it Japanese? No. Just it's, purple yam. it's purple yam, purple yam cake. It's so good, guys. It's so good. Um, yeah, so all those are coming, so please stay tuned. What does M say? M said funnel cake. Yes, funnel cake, definite one. Definite. Actually, that's what I, I um, was telling Christian earlier. I said, I told her that that would be my next recipe, the funnel cake. But it was just, you know, it's just like, thinking about ideas, but I definitely want to do a funnel cake. Has to have ice cream on top with cream mm -hmm. and a little bit of strawberry drizzle. Strawberry drizzle? <laughs> cherry. Or cherry. I love cherry or uh, apple, kind of apple sauce. Yes. Mm -hmm. This is so good. You should put this in the freezer. Is it cold? Yeah. Any more ideas? Okay, so we got desserts. Um, would you guys like to see videos of me like doing a shopping haul? I think Nicole suggested that, and Nicole, I am working on on that. Amir suggested um, the. Oh yeah, Amir su suggested the. Oh, you did the seasoning. Seasoning, yes. Amir. Did you see? Is yeah, Amir? Did you see the seasoning, the spices I did? And Nicole suggested the shopping, the oh, grocery, yeah. yes. Which you did part. Yes, uh, Nic yeah. yes, Nicole, I am. But the thing is, Jackson and I were in the grocery store the other day. And I was, but I don't know if you can, I was doing it. I was taking some on my phone, but I turned. Shit, yeah. Nicole, trust me, it's coming. Okay, it's coming. It's coming. I got a, I got a grocery shopping to do. Ooh, so Nicole said caramel. You like caramel, caramel and your caramel on, um. Okay. Um, that would be good. That's yeah, that'd be good. I'm not really like a caramel. Cream with caramel yeah, that would be Ooh, pretty delicious. Okay. Um said when's the oxtail nachos coming? <laughs> when the price of oxtail go down. <laughs> oxtail is now ten, what, ten ninety nine a pound, right? I think I'm no, 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 we will. He wants to taste okay, test. yes, okay. Okay, M's just for you. Oxtail Nicole nacho. said, looking for the oxtail pizza or the oxtail sandwich made with plantain. Oh, that, yeah. Yes, the, I remember she was. Yes, yeah. that's good. 
Crop I'm Soup Pizza is uh, popular. It, I think it's in New, New York. York. Mm-hmm. Yeah, people, a... people like the line bend around the corner. Yes, for these pizzas. I wonder how they afford to do that pizza though, because, but it looks really. I good. remember they use cold teal. Um, who knows? Candace said, "Have you ever made your own chocolate bar?" No, no. no. Oh, pizza. what? No, actually, no chocolate. Um, uh, Christmas one Christmas I did like chocolate Santa Claus and stuff. No, but I didn't do a chocolate bar yeah. itself. No. Or homemade candies. Mm. The homemade cho- the chocolate bar seems um yeah fun. Yes. I think people do like gummy worms, like homemade gummy worms. You know, homemade gummy. Yeah. yeah. I think this Christmas I will try like you know some candies, like some Christmas. Some yeah. Christmas stuff. Maybe even candy cane. And said, Nicole, you might be on something. <laughs> the oxtail pizza and the pizza. Sandwich. Yeah, that's pretty popular in New York. The pizzas. The oxtail pizzas. But everything, guys, is so expensive nowadays. Like, oh my goodness. You just have to shut your eye tight and buy it. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You know what? I don't mind. Making these recipes for you guys is amazing. It's amazing. And said, oxtail tacos, the shell will be plantain. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's that's a, a good like one. A crispy, like a, what do you call it? The to, to, uh, tostonos. Tostonis. <laughs> tostonis. Yeah, because it's like. Listen, I have a heavy tongue, so whatever I say, it's just like, oh. <laughs> but you'd have to use, with that, you, I think you'd need to use green plantain. Okay. Because it's firm, yeah. right? The the ripe one would just kind of flip flop. Or so. have you ever made like a, the planted lasagna? Remember you still no, love that? Oh my god! Oh, That's I tried. Good. I tried once, yeah, but it wasn't as good as um, the one I had at that party. Yeah, it was a, a Dominican. Yeah, was a Dominican. Yeah, my Dominican friend. I went to her party. Oh my goodness! What? But I'm sure that they don't really call it. I don't know what it's no, called, but it's not it's, called. Uh, but it was so good, guys. So good. It was like a layer of. It's like instead of the the noodle, it's plantain. Yes, right? so it was like a layer of plantain. It was a layer of ground beef. What? Yeah, it was a layer yeah. of ground beef, and then it was something else. Yeah. I don't. Something sweet. I have said, or hear me out. Akin saltfish with plantain waffles. <laughs> I can't selfish with plantain waffles. That's that's doable. That's easy. That's simple. It's like chicken and waffles. Yes, waffle, yes, yes. I can't selfish. Yes. Like, yeah, yeah. Kind of. Okay. Yeah. That's a good idea. Mm-hmm. That's a good idea. Ems, keep them coming. You have great ideas. I can see that you're a foodie. <laughs> <laughs> Any more ideas? Cubs Den? Mrs. Cubs Den, what's your what's your idea for for uh for recipes here? You have a patty recipe? Who asks you? No, patty recipe? Emma. Yeah, recipe. Oh. On your I think you did patties. Yes, yes, I did patties. Guys, I make I made patties. Um so the the video is there on my channel. And I also said, made I also made patties for uh Jackson because he loves patties so much. <laughs> the little boy looked at the patty and he goes, That's not patty. <laughs> He's used to Tanel's. Yeah, so he's used to a certain patties from a certain patty shop. Yeah. Okay? Mm-hmm. And he he's uh friends with the lady in there. Yes. And he's friends with, he goes with the so lady. Much. Mm-hmm. Yes. Jackson. Um, and to- said you gotta pay me for these ideas. <laughs> Nicole said, Ems, when is the restaurant opening up? <laughs> exactly. Mm-hmm. That's great ideas, and great, 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 great ideas. Thank you so much. And you see, we we have a list here. We have a list. So after all these ideas, guys, before we go, I'll tell you what I decided that the next recipe will be, okay? So I'm eventually going to do all of these, but I'll tell you what the next one. Maybe maybe three, maybe two or three before summer is... Um, is up and then we're gonna start doing some um, fall recipes right right some fall recipes like maybe chilies and 
um, stews. Yeah. What do you guys think about doing a? I was saying Christy before. She goes, no, I wouldn't try it. Like, I don't know if they say rabbit stew, rabbit. No, oh my god. god. <laughs> I've seen a great no, 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 I guess it. She was like, no, I'm never going to try rabbit. Like, if you do a rabbit stew. But I don't know. Have you guys ever tried, like, rabbit? rabbit? Yeah. No. no yeah, I was no, watching, no. Um, I think it was Food Network the other day. Um, they were doing a great, um, some recipes. I don't recipes. Even want the rabbit in here. Like, <laughs> that's just crazy. I've had it. You never had it. Of course not. I've had it. I think I, the first time I've had rabbit was when you I was probably. said no. Was when I was probably 10, 10 years old. old. No. When I was 10 years old, I ate, I had supper at my friend's house. And I thought I was eating chicken. And her mom goes, do you know what you're eating? I'm like, chicken? She goes, no, it's rabbit. I'm like, okay. <laughs> and I just said, I've never tried rabbit. Would you, Candace? Would you? Could never be me. Uh uh. I don't know. I when you know, I think I'd be seeing the cute little bunny. Oh, <laughs> Kristen's like, oh my god. Pets should stay pets, huh? Yeah. <laughs> I always see that when I go to like in Metro supermarket there. No, but I I don't think I don't think I would. But I am going to do a curry duck. Okay, guys? I mean, I'm not really interested in that. <laughs> Ducks are so cute. Mm -hmm. No, they're not. Come on. They're not. What do you guys think about curry duck? Candace said I wouldn't eat it. It's too cute. Yeah. What? Rabbit? Rabbit. Oh, I know. I know, they're Candace. So cute. But the recipe they were doing on Food Network was nice. It was a good recipe. Have you seen any bunnies in your backyard, Candace? Or anybody here? Nicole, Williams family. I don't coyotes. Like bunnies. No, 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 not coyotes. <laughs> not coyotes. There's a lot of coyotes now. Yeah, but I think it's outside. Candace said her. yes. Yes. Oh. <laughs> See, I'm doing like, oh, they're so cute. Dwight. Hello, Chef Dwight. How are you? How are you? I checked the I checked the other day if you posted anything new. Didn't. No, Chris, I'm not gonna click that. Don't worry. <laughs> How are you? Welcome, Chef Dwight. I just made um. You missed my pina colada. Um, recipe I just did. I drank probably half of it. It was so good. What would you like to see me uh, cook next, Chef Dwight, on my channel? Mm. Ooh. You guys, would you guys like to meet um, Luca? Would you guys like to meet Luca? Oh, he was crying. He just woke up. Hi. <laughs> Hi. You guys want to meet him? Thank you. Guys, here is Luca. That's baby Luca. Say hi. Say hi. Say hello. Say hello. Say hi. <laughs> Any comments for Luca? Chef Dwight said, how are you doing, Marie? I'm doing good. I'm doing good, Chef Dwight. I'm doing good. How are you? I'm doing good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Guys, this is a foodie here. This is my little foodie. He loves to eat. He eats everything. He eats everything. And he goes into tantrums for food. Yep. <laughs> yes. Okay. Say good night. Say bye-bye. Say bye-bye. He should be sleeping. He was sleeping, guys, and he woke up. Oh. Check the way. Read the, read the comments for me, Kristen. <laughs> William Sammy said, he's so big. What a cutie. 
Say thank you, Luca. Chef Dwight said, I'm okay relaxing. Oh, what are you gonna what are you cooking? What did you cook today, Chef Dwight? All your recipes are so scrumptious. Look so scrumptious. What did you guys have for dinner today? What time is it now? What did you have for dinner today? <clears throat> what did you have for dinner? What did I have for dinner today? Okay, so I had salmon with rice. And you know what kind of salmon I had? The um the one in the in the tin. Yeah, canned salmon. That's what I had. I should just bought the 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 salmon steak because nowadays the one in the tin is almost the same price yeah salmon it is, is it, uh, yes it's so good guys it's so curious. good yes just made some um jasmine rice and i cooked up the salmon sauteed some onion tomato sweet sweet pepper um put a little bit of garlic what else thyme put a few pieces of thyme leaf um and then just throw the salmon in there and if you have some grease seasoning, you know the fish seasoning, you just add some of that, but not the not the noodle part. You just put the powder part. And that's it. Simple, simple, simple. Simple. And that was very yummy. And you can add asparagus. You could steam some asparagus and put with it. Or if you don't want rice, you just cut up some tomato, lettuce, you know. Nicole, uh, Chef Dwight said nothing yet. Nicole said nothing yet. Oh, nothing yet. Okay. Still, still early. It's still, yeah. yeah. It's still early. It's still early. It's still early. What did you have? Williams family, Mrs. Cubs Den. Um, did Candice say she had something? Not yet. Nicole. Oh, Nicole said she, uh, nothing yet. How much people now? Mm -hmm. Amir, what did you have? What did you have? Um, oh, Amir didn't have dinner yet. Yes. <laughs> what do you feel like? What are you guys feeling for? Mm -hmm. What did you have today, Williams family? She's in, they're in Jamaica, so I'm sure it can be great. <laughs> I know. Oh, gosh. <laughs> they're in Jamaica. It's going to be fantastic. Williams like, family said Patty. Patty? Don't make Jackson hear that. No, no, no. <laughs> no Jackson be like, Patty, can I go? Patty from where? Cheese patty. Ooh. Oh, cheese patty. But the cheese patty have beef in there, right, Williams family? I was kind of, I was kind of surprised with that because uh, I thought it was just cheese. I didn't know it have. Tasty. Does it have? Oh, okay, tasty. 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 Okay. Yes. Yes, they have meat in there. Okay. <laughs> I remember when I was a little girl <clears throat> in Jamaica, I remember my grandmother, I remember going to Black River with my grandmother and there was this bakery there. They had the best cocoa bread ever. Was that your favorite thing I mean, to eat? cocoa bread, bread, yes. That's, yes, I used to love going out with my grandmother because she'd buy cocoa bread and patty. And I mean, the smell of the cocoa bread, you could just eat it like that without no patty. <laughs> you could just eat it like that. And the same bakery had like buns and the bun was hot and that was in black river what was your favorite like treat like sweet my favorite when sweet you were, yeah, yeah. at that time i remember we lived in uh saint elizabeth so where we lived you know was a long way in whatever and whoever the bigger cousin they would go to the shop. So you give them your little 10 cent and they would come back with, <laughs> they'd come back with like 10 um, gum, you know, like we used to call it chewing gum. So, <laughs> so you used to come back with 10 of those. I can't even remember what my favorite was at the time, but. Candace said, Karina made fried dumpling, ackee and saltfish. Ooh, Karina? Wow. Oh my goodness. Amazing. William Sami said, I love ackee and saltfish patty too. Oh, um, I didn't they sell that at um, Tinel's? No, the what's it called? The place they sell. Uh, oh, I can't. Uh, Superlicious. Super Superlicious. Superlicious. Yes. Oh, they sell it. Okay. Yes, they sell all kinds. Um, I can't selfish patty. I've never had, but oh my goodness! Wow. See, in Jamaica, you can get everything coming in a patty. They put everything in a patty. Yeah. 
and it's delicious. It's so good. It's so good. And it said my mom taught her how to make it. How to make the oh the yes oh. You see, Karina, man, and Karina is all old screen and okay. It's good to teach okay. them from young. Of course. It's good, it's good to teach your children how to cook from their young. You know, if you're in the kitchen cooking, let them sit in the kitchen. I used to sit in the kitchen and watch my mother cook, you know, and I think after I used to, okay, guys, so for, <laughs> so the first time I, I uh, even tried to cook anything, my mother was uh, gone to work. I came home from school and I was hungry because I never ate the lunch she leave for me. I used to just dump it in the garbage and throw it down the chute. And, um, yeah, so I used to cook, uh, try cook rice. So what was the lunch she, so th she made for you? What was the lunch she left for me? It was like the spaghettios and beefaroni. I, I, no. Yum. No, no, no. <laughs> no, 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 no. I threw it in the garbage, honestly, and make it look like I ate it. I'm sure you guys all did that. Come on. <laughs> yeah, so I used to like bake and cook when my mother was at work. And when she came home, she would yell at me because I <laughs> once I was cooking, I made um, rice with butter. Okay, so one time, remember, she made me rice and she put butter. I think it was a seasoned rice, and I tried to make it. So I made the rice. The rice, it was it was bad. I didn't know the measurements or anything, so I cooked a whole <laughs> pot of rice, and it was like she was upset. So anyways, so I you tried. You wasted all the rice. I wasted all the, I wasted all the rice, yes, where <laughs> I tried to bake a cake. Yeah, that was something. But you know what, guys? Just try. Just have your children in the in the kitchen, and if they show some interest in cooking, let them let them cook. Let them try. Because you know, one day they'll cook for you, so it's good. Do your children have any interest in cooking? Who said that? <laughs> you? <laughs> if my children have any interest in cooking, um, well, no. <laughs> No, actually, my daughter, actually, Kristen, she, you know what? She's not really into cooking the Jamaican food, any West Indies food, um, but um, she'll cook Canadian stuff. Yeah. And she can follow a recipe because when she was younger, I used to tell her, you remember, I say, okay, I cook this Sunday. You look up her recipe. And, cook. and she did. She did. She, she did. Your son can make pretty good. Jamaican like rice and peas. No, my son, he is um addicted to making dumpling. <laughs> so with him it's dumpling. And he also tried the rice and pea. He'll try, he'll try some little thing. Yeah. So and cousins of mine, they, they can cook. They know how to cook. My sister, she'll cook. Natasha yeah. knows how to cook what? Yeah. Yeah, she'll cook. But I think it's more Canadian, right? Yeah. I think it's more Canadian, yeah. Natasha will try stuff. She will try. Yeah, she'll try to cook. Stuff. Yeah, she'll try to yeah. cook stuff. I mean, you know, just try something, guys. I mean, follow a recipe. You know, they can't go wrong. Read the recipe. Read your recipe well. Buy all the ingredients and just throw it together. There you go. Right. Your sister's a good cook, but she loves your cooking. Yes. <laughs> That's good. That's good. Same with my daughter. She loves my cooking, too. Yeah. <clears throat> That's right. Do you guys do a menu for the week? Or you just, uh, just go with it, you know? Just go day by day. You tried that. but <laughs> I tried the menu for the week. Uh-uh. It doesn't, no, because you know what? Because when the day comes, you yeah. probably feel like something else. Or... Yes, yes. Like, if even if I say I'm going to make, um, say, subs tomorrow, when tomorrow comes, I might think about doing ackee and saltfish, you know? Since you have a lot of ackee. Since I have a lot of ackee, guys. So, No Frills had ackee for four ninety nine dollars 10 Ackee. Ackee. You want me to say ackee? Yeah. Okay. They had ackee. <laughs> for four ninety nine a tin last week, and I said, "Oh, I'm not going because there's gonna be a crowd and thing." So, 
I decided I was out, you know, I was out on the road. So I said, you know what? Let me just pass by. When I passed by, they had two boxes there full, four ninety nine. I pick up six. Any comments you're reading? Hi, Luca. Hi. Four ninety nine. So I bought six guys, and I probably make. I probably, you know what? I'll do a recipe. Maybe I'll do the one that M should suggested. Anything I can't see. Hmm. Um, William Sammy said day by day. Mm -hmm, exactly. Um, uh, Candace said it's hard to stick with a menu. Day by day is best for my family. Mm -hmm. Yeah, day by day is better. It's better, yeah. yeah. Um, William Sammy said miss the sale. Candace said I missed the sale too. My mom bought some. Mm -hmm, good. Yeah. Like I, I think they were like limiting people after a while. Were I've they? seen like Somewhere I seen a video where they had it behind the cash, like limiting. Oh only three, no! Because people were buying like mm -hmm. crazy. No, at no frills, I could have picked up the whole box of fifty. Yeah. And buy it, yeah. But I think after a while they. Were after a while, yeah. Limiting. I was just shocked that it was still there. I was shocked. Five ninety nine, and it's at um, Metro for ten. I think ten forty nine or something, and the price jumped at Walmart from seven. From like seven forty nine to ten something, within within what two months? Oh, People shit. crazy. I mean, that's why I miss uh, the West Indies. No, you have Aki tree in your backyard, in your front yard. Here is yes. ridiculous. But you know, it's what it is. Just have to give thank God for you know for everything that we have still. Oh, Luca, Luca is mashing up the place, guys. So what do you guys, uh, what should I say, cooking tomorrow or? Cooking tomorrow. So what's on your menu for tomorrow, guys? What's on your menu for tomorrow? I don't even know what I'm cooking tomorrow for dinner. But. Subs. Subs. Guys, she makes the best subs. Oh, you have to do a video of okay. your subs. I'll do a video on subs. I just said the next video will be a dessert. You know yeah, what? I'll, okay, so you know what? If I'm going to do subs tomorrow... I will maybe I'll do a live tomorrow while making the Sub, subs. Yeah. yeah. While we're making the subs. You know, you, once you try these subs, you'll never go back to Mr. Sub or what's the other one? Subway? And buy subs. Yeah, William Stanley says yes, we have them, but they're not open and they can't stay on the tree. Oh. So it's bad, right? Yeah. You yeah. You you have you to wait until it yeah. open. Oh. You have to wait until it's open, guys. But you know what? I'll come back tomorrow if we're gonna if we're gonna do subs. Yeah, that would be good. Yes, and then you'll you know we'll just see. You guys can um cook up could cook along. Maybe I'll tell you the ingredient. And then when I'm when I'm doing the live, would you like that? And then we could all just cook do cook, so. yeah. I don't know if you can get your hand on. Of course, you can get your hand on the ingredient, William family. Cook with me live. Yes. Yeah, so basically, it's just the you know any bread that you want like a sub it's well, what's the bread called called? submarine it's not submarine loaf or. loaf or something okay so you know it's about that size and then you get your um deli meats so you can get like from the deli you can get like turkey you can get ham if you eat ham you can get um what else roast beef so yeah. i usually get roast beef turkey the last um, time we got porchetta porchetta um Whatever deli meat you like, whatever. So I usually get like a three, three different type of deli meat. And you get your lettuce, your tomato, your onion, and um, and you get whatever sauce you want to get, you like. You know, it could be any salad dressing or whatever. So you can get that and then we'll do a live tomorrow yeah. around, let me see what time I get home. Like it could be six because they're dinner time. Seven. Seven? Seven maybe. Okay. Could do it like maybe at seven, as what Christian say. So I'll definitely remind you guys and we can do that. If you're interested, let me know. Just put like a thumbs up emoji and let me know. Or tomorrow we should do it or yeah, it's kinda cause it because I don't think they'll have enough time to get all the ingredients. 
<laughs> well, you can do like one, and then maybe you can go again. The yes, time. yes. Like okay. they can see all the ingredients. Okay. And okay. Then you can... Yes. Okay. So maybe I'll get the stuff, and then I'll just go live, and then we can just do subs, and yeah. So William's family, how how is the family adapting to the hot weather in Jamaica? Because I know it's hot, right? I'm saying here is hot, but mm -mm, Minoa, Minoa said Jamaica is scorching. I think there is comments, Kristen. Here's not too hot today, though. So today was good. The weather here is um, rainy. It was dark most of the day, I think. Well, this morning was, was pretty chilly. dark. Yeah, it was it was a bit chilly, yeah. So definitely that indicates that we're um summer is almost over. Right? And in the night it's getting real yeah. um chilly. I was just saying I can't wait for pumpkin spice season. Pumpkin spice. <laughs> you mean your the Starbucks flavor and Tim Hortons? Yeah. Yeah. Tim Hortons, Starbucks, McDonald's, they do their pumpkin spice. Yeah. There's definitely more comments. I see. Different. Oh, you're making this bubble. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and Williams Henry says, boy has a heat rash. We had to get oh, AC installed. Yep. I kind of thought so. I kind of thought so. That's so hot. Yes. Like, yes. Because I went to Jamaica. I took, I took uh, my baby to Jamaica many moons ago. And that's what happened. There was a heat rash and it was bad. And she was, what, four months at the time. So, poor thing. And, you know, he, he got to wear the diapers, too. Oh, my God. So, you could imagine that. Chef Dwight said, I miss summer already. <laughs> you miss summer? I don't. I oh love fall. Oh, my God. Um, I love fall. My favorite is fall and spring. No, I like summer. This summer wasn't too bad. It wasn't, it wasn't too bad. It's nice. Like the sun on you, the heat is it feels good. Not when it's not when it's too hot though. But I'm gonna yeah, I probably miss it. I don't know. The cold weather is kinda scary to think about, honestly. It's just like having to get ready with all the layers, yeah. you know, like a cold. Yeah, boots. to wear the layers and yeah. all that, yeah. But I don't like when it goes into like 36 and yeah, oh, that, that's insane. That's insane. Hot. How long are we gonna? We're gonna be on for next one. Okay. Where did they open it? Okay, guys. So they just opened a crumble cookie um, shop uh -huh. here here in Toronto, oh, and Mississauga. Mississauga in Mississauga. Okay. Have you guys tried the crumble cookie? Am I saying it correctly? Yeah, crumble yeah. cookie. Yeah. Have you tried it? had it like once a few months ago i find it very sweet though it's like insane sweet yeah but i think they said like one cookie is like four servings so for one four cookie people, yes yeah, the oh my god if you buy one cookie make sure that you're you're um you're sharing it yeah make sure you're sharing it and you have one whole bottle of water <laughs> <laughs> so they just opened it here in toronto have you guys tried it have you guys had it crumble cookie I think it's close to the Krispy Kreme. Oh, oh. Because yeah, oh. they're both in Mississauga. Oh, okay, yeah. okay. So they put like two insane sweet yeah, beside each sweetness other. beside each other. Imagine Krispy Kreme and crumble cookie beside each other. Mm -mm. That is insane. Chef Dwight says, what's coming after fall? I don't want it. <laughs> <laughs> Winter. <laughs> winter. Winter. Oh my gosh. I don't want it either. You know? I don't want either. Winter is difficult. It's difficult to get, you know, to get to one place to the next. You have to climb snow, especially here in Toronto. Winter tires. Winter tires. You gotta get winter tires. A lot of money. Um yeah. I'm not looking forward to winter. That's mm -mm. I actually enjoyed the summer. I actually enjoyed it. Um, the nights now are getting real cold. My plants are like, I see it suffering a bit. Yeah. So, and the holidays are coming fast. You guys notice in the stores how they're trying to um, 
I'd say suffocate us with like uh, false stuff. Hallow um, what's the Halloween stuff they have? I haven't seen a little bit of Christmas stuff. Well, you said I don't even want to hear that word. Winter? <laughs> <laughs> you know I hear that. Trust me. Actually, I went to Carter's for kids' clothes the other day. Carter's, yeah. And the girl said in the back they have all, like, uh, winter coats and what? snow pants. Yeah, she said oh, the back. Oh, you hear that? Cool. Oh, my goodness. They have, like, winter coats and stuff at Carter's in the back for kids already. Yeah. But even, where was I? Was I... Oh, I went to winners. Oh my god, all sweaters. Yeah, all sweaters. Getting prepared. All sweaters are ready. They're crazy. <laughs> Nicole said your cookies are better. <laughs> oh, thank you, <laughs> thank you. They're not that sweet, right, Nicole? I mean, yeah, because you don't want it like your cookie too sweet. Yes, and I think with all the toppings. Yes, like, they have like a uh, cheesecake. Cookie, yeah, they have cheesecake cookie. Mm -hmm. And that's the thing nowadays with these shops, yeah. cupcakes and cookies. They, the amount of toppings they put on it to like, yes. you know, catch you, like draw your attention to it. It's Nicole insane. Nicole said your cookies are better. Thank you. Thank you, Nicole. Thank you, Nicole. The good thing, William's family, um, about living in or vacation in Jamaica, it's so hot down there. You don't even want to eat. Uh, you know, you don't want eat, I don't. Well, when I'm down there, I don't even think I want to eat like um, a full plate of food. All of my intention is to drink water because I'm so hot. No, I'll eat a full plate. You'll eat a full plate. There's no food like oh my God. the food down there. Yes, but all my intention is just to eat like drink water, yeah. fruits, eat fruits, coconut. fish. Yes. Coconut water. Coconut water. Coconut jelly. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Jackson. Oh my Bye goodness. Bye. <laughs> you showed them your bad habits. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Not with that. Okay, he's showing you his um Okay, you're supposed to be in bed, right? <laughs> no, you don't. <laughs> Jackson's going to bed, guys. He thinks it's funny he's showing you his uh susu like his little habit there. So good. Wait, um, William somebody says, Yes, true, but the food is too good. I want to eat it all. See, so, yeah, that's oh what I said. Goodness. I haven't been to Jamaica in such a long time. Okay, guys. So, Kristen, just remind me. Okay, so we're going to have a, a 1K giveaway on the next live. Okay? So the giveaway is going to be good. I've had giveaway. We had a few giveaways before. We had one, yeah. One. Was it one? Yeah. Yeah, okay, one. But this one's going to be good. You don't want to miss it. Could you give a hint on what's in the giveaway? Like, no. is, is it a package? Is it? A it's going to be a package. It's going to be like my favorite things for the kitchen. Right. Right. My favorite things for the kitchen. So it could be spices. It could be um, kitchen towels and spices. So it's not like one. It's just like a. So I think I. That's not really a hint. I'm really telling you. Okay. So it's going to be my favorite kitchen things. And my homemade pepper sauce. Yeah. Mm. So it's going to be good. It's going to be good. I might just keep it for myself. <laughs> it's going to be good, guys. 1,000. Yeah, you know, it. Uh, I got here slowly, but, um, but I'm here, right? I've been on YouTube for what now? Three years. Over three years. It doesn't matter how long. I'm yeah, she used. says it doesn't matter. But, yeah, three years. It took time. But now, guys, I'm just going to work hard and throw out those recipes and bring you along with me to the grocery stores and stuff. And I'm not shy about uh, vlogging outside. I am not shy about not. <laughs> I am not. I'm not really shy. I think Kristen's more because sometimes she comes with me. She's uh, right, Kristen? Yeah. yeah. If you're going to vlog, I'm not coming with you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not shy at all. So I'm going to take it. Look. That's good for them mm -hmm. if they look. 
you're not pointing the camera at nobody. You're just pointing it at food. So that's that's okay. See, William Stanley says, I'm shy. I know. Yeah. <laughs> I know. I know you are. I am not Christian. My daughter is. Yep. She'll be like, Mom, no. But, but no. You know what? You just got to, like, I don't know. You got to, like, put that aside, right? It's because, easy to say. Yeah, you because you got to commit, right? Because... Um, YouTube and doing food videos, you got it's a commitment. Yeah. You know, you got to put your all into it. And I think the last three years, I wasn't really, I wasn't put my all. I would like put up a video a couple months after, you know, I do. But now, like, it's not like no. I love to, I love to do, I love doing what I do. I love to cook and I love to showcase and I love to show you guys and I love to, you know, do tutorials on it. And I'm getting better. And yeah. And now I'm just trying to put my all into it. So I'm be going out there with my camera. And yeah, whoever don't like it, that's too bad. <laughs> so what time are yes. you gonna be on live tomorrow? Yes. And I you know what? And I'm gonna I'm gonna um ask ask my cousin about this one. She is a good cook, right? So I'm gonna go to her house and video and um, she's gonna do a recipe and we're gonna video her doing a, her favorite uh, meal for her family. So I'm not even asking her. I'm just telling her I'm coming. <laughs> I'm coming. What time is your live tomorrow? Uh, what time can you guys be here for the live tomorrow? We're going to do subs. I think everybody's in different time zones. Yes, so everybody's kinda... in different time zones. Jamaica, Edmonton, um, I know Mrs. Cubs then her time zone's the same. It says should be the same as here. I'm not sure. I know she's in Canada, but I'm not sure where okay. in Canada. Um, Nicole said, yes, 1,000. Let's go, Maria. Yes. There you go. And hopefully my sister, when she comes to Toronto, <laughs> she can cook something and we can, you know. She don't have to, like, show her whole self on it because some people don't want to show. I understand that. But. Your hands and what you do is fine. <laughs> <laughs> yes, so 1,000 and counting on. So maybe uh, 7 tomorrow for... 7 tomorrow, yes. And we're going to do a giveaway. Yeah. So, yes, we're going to do a giveaway. So we're going to have questions. I'll let Christian think about the questions. So wherever you are, we're going to send your, your gift. It yep. doesn't matter if you're in... China, if you're in North Pole, it, do, it doesn't matter. Like North Pole, Rudolph could come and get it and deliver it to you, <laughs> but it's coming to you. Yeah. Hmm. Anything else? Okay, just, uh, 6 p.m. or 7 p.m. is fine. Yeah, well, mm -hmm. 7 p.m. We'll, we'll 7 p.m., yes, 7 p.m. So, what are the questions okay. going to be? It's going to be can... food. It's going to be food related. It'll be related, yeah, food related. We'll just do a couple questions. They will be not too many because yeah. we're going to be doing the subs as well. Yes. Um, and then person with the most points mm -hmm. gets. Uh, yes. So some is going to be about sub the, the what we're making, or it'll be like food related. Yes, you know, it's like going to be kitchen food. food. Yes. So two of the questions is going to be about what what I made here. Yeah. Okay. Something maybe one of the ingredient or. So seven p.m. Seven. PM. Seven p.m. Guys. Come Don't on, miss it. The prize. Yes, there's gonna be a great, a great prize. A great a, gift basket. A, yes, a great gift basket with my favorite kitchen stuff, and maybe thing is gonna be in a, You guys grill? I hope any of you grill. Should we make add that grilling? Yes. Okay. So no, you'll see tomorrow, guys. You'll see tomorrow. Okay. So we're gonna what? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so we're going to, okay, so I'll see you guys tomorrow, okay? And thank you so much for coming. And I hope you enjoy this pina colada recipe and I hope you try it, okay? And if you do, just message me and tell me how you like it, okay? So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Love you. Thank you so much for coming. Bye.